why don't my children want to speak to me anymore? Why don't my children want to spend time with me anymore? Okay, let me help you figure it out. One, whenever they have tried to speak to you or they do speak to you, you always respond with anger. You always tell them that they're wrong. You tell them that you're the adult and they're the child, so they must listen to you and obey you. And that they're based, and then they internalize that as their voice doesn't matter, and that you would never listen, and you don't listen to understand, you listen to correct and to prove that you are always right, essentially. Number two, whenever they did try to speak to you or want to spend time with you, they always came second. They were always second priority. I'm too busy. I have a meeting. I have work. I'm doing something. I'll do it with you later. And that was always the response that they got most of the time or all of the time growing up. So now they don't see the point and they know that if they do ask, you're going to say no anyway. So what's the point? Whenever you did spend time with them or you did try to talk to them, somehow it always ended up being about you. It always ended up having to be done your way in the way that you like, in the way that you enjoy, or it had to somehow be about you in conversation or in advice. Somehow it was always then about you and no longer about them. So why would they come to you now when they know that it's not going to be about them and you're, and you're self-centered. When they were a child, you did not create an emotional bond with them. So they never cre created an emotional attachment to you, either because you didn't spend time with them. You didn't have the resources to be able to do that. You were always working through no fault of your own because you had to survive. So you didn't create an emotional attachment to them. So now they have no attachment to you. They just see you as somebody who's biologically their mum or dad. But there's nothing more beyond that. There's no emotional connection or attachment to you. So they have no reason to miss you, to want to be around you or to talk to you because they have nothing in common with you that's what they feel like and last but not least you've never made the effort to get to know them you've never in taken interest in who they are as a person what they like what they don't like how their day is going when they come back from school who their friends are you never took an interest in doing those things you didn't celebrate things with them you didn't get involved in anything personal in their lives so they feel like they don't know you and they have nothing to talk to you about and they have created those bonds and made memories with other people in their lives their friends and their partners so you are essentially just somebody who gave birth to them and brought them into this world or who was just a biological parent and that's it